Good afternoon Muay Thai fans, Kevin Noon here from the World Boxing Council. I'm the Secretary General of the WBC Muay Thai. Just want to invite everyone, every Muay Thai fan, every Muay Thai aficionado, promoter, fighter, ring official, to Bangkok on March 14 to 16 for the first ever WBC Muay Thai World Convention. We have three days of fantastic activities. We have a two day ring official seminar and workshop where physical demonstrations will take place, a lot of theory, some exams, a lot of uh, knowledge sharing by three of the most eminent uh, ring officials in the world, Dr. Tawood from Channel 7, Mr. Nokweed from California, and the new generation, Mr. Panu. Also, we have a fantastic night of WBC Muay Thai Elite World Title Fights at Lumpini Stadium. We have rented the stadium for one night. It's a private event, Sunday, March 15th. We have a fantastic uh, gala dinner celebrating Thai food, Thai culture. It's going to be a, an amazing gathering here in Bangkok. Everyone is welcome. We don't care what organization you work for, represent, fight for. Everyone is welcome. March 14 to 16, we will also celebrate former WBC Muay Thai world champions when we induct our first ever WBC Muay Thai Hall of Fame. And it's going to be an incredible gathering here in Bangkok at the Aitani Hotel in central Bangkok. Please join us. The World Boxing Council is the uh, most eminent sanctioning body of uh, professional boxing and now professional Muay Thai in the world. Of course, we're associated with legendary champions like Muhammad Ali, Floyd Mayweather, Sugar Ray Leonard, Mike Tyson, current champions like Deontay Wilder and of course we have love for Mr. Tyson Fury and that big rematch happens next month in Las Vegas. Of course the most important one for us right now here in Thailand is the WBC Muay Thai. Uh, the history of the WBC Muay Thai it was came into inception in 2004 and we have crowned champions from all over the world. American champions such as Miriam Nakamoto, Kevin Ross, Joe Schilling and many many more. The uh, WBC Muay Thai puts great importance and legitimacy on our world champions making regular defenses of their world championships. Under WBC Muay Thai rules, a champion should defend his belt within six months of winning that championship. Obviously there are some contextual circumstances where a champion cannot defend the belt and the WBC takes that into consideration. But champions like Yusef Bouganim and Sean Clancy, these are our current middleweight champion and super lightweight champion respectively. Both of these fighters are striving to make regular defenses. And by doing so, they're adding legitimacy to their belt. By becoming a champion, you don't just win the belt and then put it on the shelf. You're solidifying your, the value to your career and the legacy you build as a champion to work and regularly defend the world championship within a reasonable time frame. The upcoming WBC Muay Thai World Convention will feature a sensational night of elite Muay Thai action at Bangkok's Lumpini Stadium. We have three WBC Muay Thai World Title fights. Yusef Buganem will defend his middleweight championship against Sakrao Pejindi from Thailand. Louis Kajaiba will defend his welterweight championship against Sidichai Sitsang Pinong and Satanfa Ratchanan will defend his super welterweight world championship against the feared Yadwicha Por Boon Sit. And of course, Kulab Dam Sorjor Pietutai, the executioner, a favorite of Mr. Liam Harrison, will fight against Shamuok Tong from PK Sanchai Muay Thai Gym for the first ever WBC super lightweight Thailand championship. And we just added Dizelek Udon Moang, formerly known as Dizelek, now currently known as Capitan Pechin D to the fight card. He will fight an unnamed opponent uh, as of yet. And of course, we have one boxing fight on the event, the WBC Asia Lightweight Championship. So a sensational night of elite Muay Thai at Bangkok's Lumpini Stadium, Sunday, March 15th, 6.30 p.m. Tickets will go on sale from February 1st. Do not miss it, it will be a sensational night of Muay Thai action. Last but not least, I want to thank every Muay Thai fan, promoter, fighter, ring official around the world. The WBC appreciates the respect and love that our brand has got over the last uh, two to three years and historically back since 2004. I want to say thank you to everyone and I hope to see you all in Bangkok March 14 to 16 at the Aitani Plaza, which I believe will be a wonderful weekend of a gathering of Muay Thai people in Bangkok.